Good morning, everyone. I'm Sweet Money, and welcome back to Airport CEO. We finally finished zoning and straightening out any messes that came up. Today, we'll be doing some random stuff around the airport and expanding a little bit. If you enjoy this video, don't forget to leave a like and comment so the YouTube overlords know to show this to more people. Let's get to work. All right. Yeah, we're like all we're all zoned and it looks like we still have a couple of staff problems, but not really. Let's see if we can find where we might have some staff problems really quick. Let's hit up our our terminals and see which ones are turning red. Uh, janitors in B, we might be a little short on, even though we have like the most janitors there almost uh let's just get some more janitors why not that's an easy fix right let's go janitor get you guys get rid of all you guys and uh by the time i go through here and make sure everyone's trained up we probably get some more janitors all right that looks pretty good let's see we got a couple more Staff happiness is at 68%. I feel like, I don't know if I care to work on that. Not sure what to do to work on that either. All right, oh, don't want that. Okay, so then let's put a few, okay. Did we already give all of our janitors away? No, well, I think we did. We had like 25 over here, right? All right, we'll go to at least 35 here. Passenger service agents is still a little low. Then we'll go to 35 here, and then let's grab the rest of that staff here. Uh, a couple more security officers, I think, are fine. Service agents, that should do it. Everyone's trained up. We got some extra staff here. Let's just see where they all went. Uh, let's go down one on that. I think we do we have like 20 over here. All right, and I just hit play, and then we'll we'll see where the numbers go. Pass for service agents. We just got some extra ones. We probably went over here, so that'll go back up to 25. And they're doing fine with 23 up here. But once I think once our staff gets stabilized in a and b we should be fine because i don't i don't intend on expanding those terminals very much anymore uh but i do i do intend on expanding c and that leads me to another tip from the comments on how trucks work so we're probably getting a few late flights right and it looks like it's c and it looks like it's catering so this is exactly what i'm going to try to fix right now never crossed my mind i don't know why it never crossed my mind but uh there there are multiple you know cars that can service an, an aircraft at the same time um and the large ones need like three or four trips so if i have enough cars to go there for both garbage and catering so i'm just gonna go two per stand i know the, the comment said the ratio is about one and a half and that works out pretty good but I just you just go two per stand. Why not, right? I'm not penny pinching yet. We're still got we're still getting staff problems, huh? Uh, ramp agents. Seven jobs available. How is it even possible? Where is our seven jobs? Hmm. Security still doing mint over here. I can't I can't hit the plus button over here. <laughs> there we go. We'll go up to 30 there. Service technicians. We got eight. We got nine. Probably way too many service technicians over here. And we still got some security issues, but. I'm just gonna try to get it close as long as we're not like steady red on a lot of things like one job available pops up that's fine as long as they get taken care of pretty quick hopefully that's fine um all right let's go to vehicles let's fix this real quick here our cabin cleaning vehicles right now we'll do an extra three order and then catering trucks we'll do an extra three order and i need a way to get them to always be here i think the other thing we could try is adding um adding the buildings somewhere closer because i mean that's a long trip in order to get over here so that's probably part of the problem then we just need to go uh, i almost forgot about this we need to assign so does that mean multiple fuel trucks can also assist um maybe i'll get like a couple of extra fuel trucks i don't know why it never crossed my mind at all like not even a little bit did i ever think we have two de-icing trucks in a stand that doesn't have any a terminal that doesn't have any de-icing so uh perhaps we'll assign some of those elsewhere all right assign two to b for right now i don't think that's necessary but are these all getting messed up how come it feels like everything's getting reassigned i know i fixed baggage cars before right now a has like a ton of baggage cars this is this is terrible if um if it kind of automatically resets things right now we got nine left over 
Okay, so we'll do six there and we'll do 12 there. So that leaves just enough for the stands and A because we don't really need more than one truck per stand. And then we have double capacity for the other spots. I hope these aren't like adjusting themselves. Like new trucks I get, although I would actually prefer if new trucks did not get assigned to a terminal automatically, especially because they keep assigning them to the, uh, the wrong terminal. All right, and then what happened with our catering truck? So we should have, what, three maybe is fine here, I guess. Three garbage trucks, three catering trucks. Should be fine for five small stands. And uh, the medium aircraft, oh no, we want six, but we don't want 10 garbage trucks. So let's go like that, and then let's see if, if this is all set. Okay, why does it feel like the game didn't give me this stuff? Maybe I only had one of each uh, in Terminal one, uh, A before. All right, let's order two more then. Then we just like kind of buffed up Terminal A a little bit, which is fine. I just gotta like re-remember how much stuff I have everywhere. Did I ever assign pushback trucks the number that we needed? We should be fine with standard pushback trucks, so we can get rid of those three. And that goes like that. How has anything been working? Those six standard pushback trucks, and then we got the three large in the other stand. Airside buses, belt loaders. Do we have belt loaders? I would assume we have belt loaders. Maybe I don't have any belt loaders. Well, I got six over here. I think belt loaders were assigned to the terminals, or uh, I'm sorry, to the stands. And we have two more garbage trucks. Uh, I guess I'll assign them down here just in case we need a couple more. We got six, we got four, three, three. Okay, so I'm just waiting on the new trucks to arrive. New products have arrived, great. They probably all got thrown down into here. Just a couple of them did. The fact that it just kind of splits them off into wherever, it's kind of the other thing that bothers me. Uh, and then we got two extras again of garbage trucks. I don't know how we keep getting extra garbage trucks. <laughs> we have so many garbage trucks. I'll put them in C. And then everything else is fine. Uh, large belt loader. No, if we need large belt loaders, right? Like we just do regular belt loaders here, which means, yeah, you go like this. That gives us six over here. And then large belt loaders come over here. And that should be even. We don't have any stair trucks. Oh, I totally forgot about these. We don't have our emergency vehicles. It's a vehicle day, I guess. Our emergency vehicles. Let's get two more of everything. And we got to make sure that there's one of each in all the terminals. All, right, all have arrived. Terminals, let's go to here. We got one of each in A. Great. And we don't need any of these things. No service cars. That's all fine. And we got one of each here and one of each here. Cool. It actually assigned them to the right spots. All right, then let's go get those three extra uh, A1 fuel trucks. And that should do it for vehicles, at least for now. This is just like a like safety almost. Make sure that we have enough. Uh, and we want to resupply at like 30%. We got a lot of fuel trucks. Actually, isn't there like a tank that I can add to this? Probably to increase the supply. Uh, fuel tank, A1. All right, I think that I think that'll be helpful, right? Terminal, and then we got six. They all went to here. Great. I think I think that's all of our cars. I think we're good. We're good. Woo! All right. What is next? What is next? Okay, we went through staff. Check. We went through vehicles. Check. I think I want to expand how many stands we have. I would probably squeeze two more stands here like really easily. So I say let's do that. And we're going to need to cut this for now. And then aircraft stand, large concrete. Take one right here and one right there. That should be perfect. Okay. We're not going to go huge. We're going to go modest here by adding two more stands. Normally with my problem with scale, I would add at least a dozen, <laughs> half a dozen more uh more stands and then everything goes to hell because we cannot support that but we can start little by little we just do two we're gonna do actual service road here i hope i did service road pretty sure i did service road and then i'll finish that off and then we're also gonna need band our terminal out to about there He's running light. Okay, our C terminal has caught up. Now all we have is A2 isn't able to land. Why is A2 still occupied? Okay, now it's fine. We're a little bit behind. Maybe some of these are going to take a second to get oh delayed. Uh, -oh. uh get caught up at least. But we're turning over the catering and trash real quick. Okay, this is can't land because C1 is occupied. Now it's fuel. We have so many fuel trucks. Apparently it's not enough. But we did it. We have like three late sea flights maybe this is just like we're we're catching up with and we haven't quite gotten to the uh totally caught up part yet but so maybe soon here i'm gonna turn these off so they don't accidentally link or anything and then we'll go stand upgrades build some jetways 
Perfect. We can connect these guys to a baggage bay just below, right there. We're waiting on this terminal to get finished. Security checkpoint, boarding desk, departure runway. Oh yeah, that's right. It's been a while since we've done any actual stands, so uh, we need taxi path. Perfect. And I think once we get the boarding desk, the security checkpoint will follow and then we're ready to go. Oh, but it's not attached to a terminal. Well, good thing it tells me. All right, while some of you guys are going home, take down that wall for me. Yeah, there you go. And then we're just gonna copy and paste this stuff over here. All right, we're just gonna wait for this to get built. Here they come through the jetway. Strange. All right, all those guys are good. And these are already linked to that. One of the few things that gets linked to, you know, whatever thing it is close to, which is nice. Oh, we gotta do one more thing before we wrap up here too. And I just thought about, I mean, aside from putting some fancy carpet on the on the floor down here, of course. That was a given, right? Are we using this orange one yet? I don't think so. There we go. Everything looks fancy. I think these are ready. Turn them on, turn them on. And allow all flights. And that should start filling up. Rename those sands real quick. Terminal C4 and Terminal C5. I think those are right. We're at flight capacity right now. So that's uh, the other thing that we're going to have to do. C4, C5. Perfect. Uh, so last thing is super easy. We need a large ATC tower and we are just going to stick it right over in our large. Oh, you know what? No, we don't want it there. I want it like up here. I don't think these need to be connected to roads or anything. They just kind of work wherever they are, which is great because uh, when we do rework our de-icing, you know, that thing I've been talking about for like 10 episodes now, I think I'm going to go with that like secondary pass through lane down here that'll lead to the just the hangar. And I think that'll work. It'll look ugly, but it'll work. All right, let's check our flights. Terminal C4 and 5. Are we scheduling stuff? We got a few days in the future. Capacity. Oh, that's a, I don't have anything scheduled that far. The flight capacity is 75 of 75. That's why we're not scheduling anything now. Let's uh, see whenever that gets done. Oh, they're working on it. I haven't checked our economy in a while. Go over here. Fences, $1 million we spent yesterday. $687,000 in operations. Operating costs, repairs are nothing. Contractors is nothing. Waste pickup costs is nothing. Our staff prices is going up but it is still just a fraction. Our staff and our vehicles are pretty much dead even. Uh, and administrative, hopefully these other stands kind of help. Fingers crossed. Oh boy, look at this mob. Does that mean, does that mean we're scheduling new flight? Nope, nope, this is all just for the terminals or stands one through three. There's so many people, but we should be able to handle more now. We're at 200, so if I go to like tomorrow, no, still nothing. Auto planner active, yeah, everything should, should just work. We just gotta wait. Do we have enough? Flights or enough uh, contracts? I thought it took like all of them. Accepted contracts, uh, airlines. You can just do like a couple of these four stars. We do have 200 flights that we can schedule. Grab them all, all the four stars. <laughs> oh, we got a plane here. It's our first flight in our new stands. Beautiful. A5 is running late. How come? It looks like you're running late. Oh, delayed. All right, that's gonna be all we have time for today. Thank you so much for watching. Next time, we'll make a full pass and try to get some shops and restaurants working in all of our terminals. Maybe if we have time, we'll work on de-icing for Terminal C. If you've enjoyed this video, please do leave a like and comment on what you think of this game. I'm having a great time with it, and I love reading all your comments. If you've been enjoying a few of my videos, maybe consider subscribing. A thousand subs isn't going to happen without you. I stream every Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday on Twitch. If you'd like to hang out with me live, there's a link below so you can follow me there. Thanks again for watching. I'll see you in the next one. But for now, please take it easy.